25 Tips to Find Cheap Flights In our modern world, air travel has become increasingly commonplace. But it can still be an expensive venture, especially if you don't know how to find the best deals. This article will give you 25 tips to help you find cheap flights, so you can travel without breaking the bank. One important tip is to be flexible with your travel dates. If you're willing to fly on a Tuesday instead of a Saturday, you're likely to find cheaper flights. Another good tip is to sign up for email alerts from your favorite airlines. This way, you'll be the first to know about any sales or special deals. Follow these tips and you'll be sure to find the best deal on your next flight. Happy travels! 1. Compare airfare prices across multiple websites. 2. Set up airfare alerts for specific routes. 3. Get to the airport early to snag a cheaper seat. 4. Use an incognito browsing window to search for flights. 5. Check an airline's baggage fees before booking. 1. Compare airfare prices across multiple websites. There's no one definitive answer to the question of where to find the best deals on airfare. However, by checking a variety of websites and using a few tried and true methods, you can greatly increase your chances of finding cheap flights. To start, it's important to know that there are a number of different airfare search engines, AS, available. These websites scan multiple airlines and travel sites to find the best prices on flights. Some popular ASE include Skyscanner, Google Flights, and Kayak. When searching for flights on an ASE, be sure to try a variety of different search terms. For example, instead of searching for flights from New York to Los Angeles, try searching for flights from New York to anywhere in California. This will give you a broader range of results to choose from. Once you've found a few flights that look promising, it's time to check the airline's own websites. This is where you'll find the most accurate pricing information. In many cases, you'll also be able to find promotions and sales that are not listed on the ASC. To find the airline's websites, simply Google the airline name followed by flights. For example, if you're looking for flights on Delta Airlines, you would Google Delta Flights. Once you're on the airline's website, be sure to enter the same search criteria that you used on the ASC. This will ensure that you're comparing apples to apples. Once you've found the best price on the airline's website, it's time to book your flight. But before you do, there are a few final things to keep in mind. First, take a look at the airline's baggage policy. This is important because airlines often charge high fees for check baggage, and these fees can add up quickly. If you're planning on checking a bag, be sure to factor that into the cost of your flight. Second, if you have any flexibility in your travel dates or itinerary, consider changing your plans to take advantage of cheaper flights. For example, flying midweek is usually cheaper than flying on the weekend. And, if you're willing to be a little flexible with your travel dates, you may be able to find a better deal. Finally, if you're not in a rush to get to your destination, consider booking a connecting flight. Connecting flights are usually cheaper than non-stop flights, and they can often be just as quick if you have a short layover. By following these tips, you can be sure that you're getting the best possible deal on your flight. And, with a little bit of planning and effort, you can find cheap flights to just about anywhere. 2. Set up airfare alerts for specific routes. One of the best ways to grab a cheap flight is to set up airfare alerts for specific routes. By doing this, you can get notified as soon as the price for your desired route drops. Here are a few tips on how to set up airfare alerts. The first step is to decide which flights you would like to be alerted about. You can be specific and only select certain routes, or you can be broad and select an entire region. Once you have a few routes in mind, the next step is to find a reliable airfare alert site or app. When looking for an airfare alert site or app, there are a few things to keep in mind. Make sure that the site or app is well-reviewed and has a good reputation. You should also check to see if the site or app covers the routes you're interested in. Once you've found a good airfare alert site or app, sign up and create an account. Once you have an account, you can start setting up alerts. You'll usually be able to select specific days, times, and prices that you're interested in. Once you've set up your alerts, all you have to do is wait for the notifications to come in. When you see that the price for your desired flight has dropped, book it right away. 3. Get to the airport early to snag a cheaper seat. If you want to snag a cheaper seat, 
one of the best tips is to get to the airport early. When you re one of the first people to arrive at the gates, you have a better chance of getting a good seat. If you wait until the last minute, you re more likely to end up in a less desirable seat, or even worse, no seat at all. Of course, getting to the airport early also has its downsides. You might have to spend extra time in the airport, which can be pricey if you need to buy food or drinks. And if your flight gets delayed, you could be stuck at the airport for even longer. But if you were able to budget your time and money, getting to the airport early is one of the best ways to get a good seat at a cheaper price.